Hey y'all, I am Luna Ray, the Gorgeous Oracle, and I'm here to do your March readings. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, North Node, or if you're cross-watching for a Gemini. Before I get into the reading, can you please like, share, and subscribe to my channel? Can you follow me on Instagram at I am underscore Justine Nicole? Everything will be down in the description box below this reading. Feel free to donate to my channel. Show my channel some love. I will highly appreciate it. So let's jump into the reading. Spirit, what messages do you have for Gemini for the month of March 2022? Spirit, what messages do you have for Gemini for the month of March? I just heard, I got love on my mind. I got love. <laughs> I just heard that on my mind. I have the King of Cups, the Two of Cups, the Magician, the Four of Cups, Strength, and the Ace of Cups in reverse, and the Queen of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Um, Gemini. I feel like you're in love with somebody, period, point blank. Gemini, I feel like you're in love with someone, but you feel as though somebody is not in love with you or they feel out of love with you. You feel like this person could be over you. I heard just getting started. Somebody could be over you, but according to you, Gemini, you feel like this, I'm just getting started. <laughs> like, um, yeah, I, uh, another message I'm getting, Gemini, you could be actually with somebody right now, but you wishing to be with somebody else, you want to be with somebody else, you're wishing to be with somebody else. And then with this Ace of Cups in reverse, yeah, I feel like... <laughs> You could be actually dating somebody. You could be actually with somebody in a commitment or partnership with somebody. But yet, you over... Look, if y'all see on her sweatshirt, it say over it. Okay? Hoodie. I said sweatshirt. On her hoodie, it said over it. I feel like you are... You over... Oh. This connection that you already in because you in love with somebody else. Another message I'm getting, you could be trying to end things with the person that you're with because you're in you're in love with somebody else. Another message I'm getting, whoever you're with, I feel like you're kind of tired of this person doing for you. You're tired of this person doing for you. I heard handicap. You could feel like this person is handicapping you or something. Or you feel hand this person make you feel handicapped because they always doing for you. And you're tired of it. Whoever this person is that's always doing for you. You want out of this connection. Because you want to be with somebody else. Another message I'm getting. You feel like somebody is over you. Because of the things that they put. The things that you put them through. Or if they put you through. However however it resonates Gemini. Um, I lost my train of thought. So Gemini. This person that you're in love with. You could be trying to manifest this person back. 
I heard hope, faith. Like you have faith that this person that y'all can get back together because you feel like this person don't love you anymore or somebody fell out of love with you or something like that. Yeah, I feel like somebody fell out of love with you. Or this is, maybe you're thinking somebody fell out of love with you because of what happened in the past. What happened in the past, I feel like somebody was sneaky and like doing shit behind somebody else's back. And then it wasn't no effort. You wasn't putting in any effort towards this situation. It's like once somebody left the other person, that's when they realized they loved that person. Like, when it was too late. Another message I'm getting, the person, if you're with somebody and you, you can't stand that person, you're over it, and you just tired of this person always doing for you. I heard respect. I feel like you don't respect the person that you're with. Gemini, you could look at somebody that you're with as pathetic. I feel like you look at this person as pathetic because you did all types of stuff behind this person's back. And then on top of that, you didn't put any effort into this connection that you're in now because somebody was always doing for you. Somebody was always putting in the effort and not you. And it's like now you're realizing... I need to get the fuck up out this connection. This is something, this is not going to work. I don't like this or I don't like people treating me. Uh, I heard like a kid because somebody is always doing for you. And you feel like you can do for yourself. You're strong. You're a man or you're a strong man. You're a strong woman and you can do for yourself. Somebody is like just over it. Another message I'm getting, Gemini, someone, the person that you're involved with now, this person could be in love with you. And you just don't understand why because you never just put any effort into this situation. I heard obvious and then it was obvious that you was doing things behind this person's back. Another message I'm getting... Gemini, you could be trying to figure out why this person haven't broke up with you or left you alone because of all the things you did to this person in their face. And you just like, hmm, I did all types of shit and I didn't put no effort and all types of stuff. But yet you still in love with me. You still want to be with me. Hell no. Nah. Um, Gemini, you're looking at the person that you're with differently now. Another message I'm getting, Gemini, if you have a kid or children with somebody else and you're separated from um, the mother of your child or the, the father of your child or children, I feel like you think about the times y'all had when y'all were all like a family, when y'all all were together and you miss that. You want that back. You want your family back. Another message I'm getting, Gemini, you could be, if you don't have any kids with the person you're separated from, the person that you're actually in love with, Gemini, I feel like you think about the future and you think about um, y'all having children together, y'all being with each other. I heard fantasize. Gemini, I feel like you, you can be fantasizing about how your life would be if you were with the person that you're in love with and if y'all had kids together and stuff. You think about this person. You think about your... I heard unborn children. Another message I'm getting, Gemini, when you get with this... The person that you're in love with, when you get with them, y'all may have three children together. It's something about three and children. Your child could be three years old. Y'all going to have three children together. Y'all separated when the child was three. It's something about three and children that I'm picking up on. Another message I'm getting, somebody is realizing... The person that they're in love with, somebody is realizing that their actions was childish. 
somebody was acting like a fucking three-year-old when they were with the person that they're in love with in the past when they when things were good when y'all were together somebody is realizing like their actions they behave like a kid another message i'm getting somebody wants forgiveness yes yeah, somebody wants forgiveness for how they behave Whoever is in love and they're not with the person that they're in love with, you want forgiveness. You want that person to forgive you. Another message I'm getting, the person that you separated from, um, you feel like that person is powerful. Somebody could be like a spiritual advisor, somebody that's in the occult. Or somebody that studies occult. Somebody that has um, like psychic abilities. I heard clairvoyant. This could be a psychic medium. A spiritual advisor. A spiritual teacher. It's some shit like that. Whoever you want. I heard odd. You feel like this person is odd. Um, maybe by the way they look or what they practice. What they do for work. I heard manifestation. Somebody could be the person that you're into, Gemini. Or Gemini, this is you. That person's into like laws of manifestation. Speaking things into existence. This person could be doing like rituals and stuff like that. You feel like it's odd, but that's why you like this person. Because of what they're into. Yeah, this could be some type of baby mama, baby daddy, soulmate, twin flame situation. Somebody is realizing, like, ever since y'all came in contact with each other and Gemini, you could have, it was like once you met your twin flame soulmate, your baby mama, baby daddy, you, I feel like you acted a plum monkey fool and you started, like, offering yourself to other people, giving to other people, but you're realizing that the people you are giving to... It's nothing compared to your uh, your other half. It, these people, a person, whoever you've been with or you've been seeing, if it's multiple people or a specific person, you're realizing like nobody is not, uh, like nobody can make you feel like how your other half make you feel. That's another message I'm getting. You're realizing. Another message I'm getting. Your life hasn't been the same since you crossed paths. Since you crossed paths with the with your person. Your ideal person. Another message I'm getting. Somebody is disappointed that they left their ideal person to um, be with other people, places, or things or something like that. Somebody feels stupid. Another message I'm getting. Somebody... Somebody not proud of themselves because it's like, damn, I've been praying and manifesting to be with my other half. And once I met my other half, I ended up leaving my other half and start offering to other people. And somebody life has not been the same since you've been gone or since this person been gone. Since your other half been gone, you could have been focusing on your money, stacking your money, um, just paying more attention to your work, your finances, your savings. I heard overwork. You could be overworking yourself because this situation... 
I heard heavy on your heart. This situation was heavy on your heart because it was like how I can't believe I passed up on my person that I, I've been praying for, asking for. Somebody used their work as distraction. And somebody feel like, you know, it things will get better. It will get better. Um, in the meantime, I'ma just work. If I have to work overtime, put in extra hours or whatever I have to do to take my mind off of this. Cause this shit was weighing heavy. I heard heavy on somebody hard. Yeah, it's like whoever left their baby mama, baby daddy, their soulmate, they twin flame. Somebody is realizing why everything happened the way it did. It's like everything makes sense now. Somebody was very toxic, very low vibrational. Uh, somebody was could have been into drugs, alcohol, porn, gambling, manipulating, um, conning people, getting over on people, then fucking with different hoes, different niggas. Somebody was just living a hot ass mess. So it's like now it makes sense why this person don't love me no more or this person fell out of love with me it's like everything it, it just makes sense to this person now i feel like this person was a hot ass mess okay somebody was a hot ass mess but it's like now with all these major arcanas out here in this reading i have one two three four five i have five major arcanas out here in this reading Somebody wants forgiveness. Somebody wants forgiveness. Somebody wants you to take them back. Somebody, they kept making like poor decisions and everything. But that's all I have for this reading, Gemini. Thank you. Bye-bye.